Right now, a foul odor leads to the body of a man known to the many in the city of Hidalgo. According to the police chief, the Hispanic man in his 60s usually travels to and from Reynosa. He says foul play is not suspected in the man's death. He was found near a grassy area where he may have been resting. An autopsy will determine exact cause of death and his name has not been released to the public just yet. Also new at six, a new order from the United States Supreme Court is placing limits on DWI laws. CBS 4's Imelda Mejia explains the court's decision and what it means for drivers. It's a significant decision. Um, both in how they frame the decision and how it's going to impact uh, cases going forward. The United States Supreme Court ruled Thursday that police officers must have a search warrant before asking drivers to take blood alcohol tests, meaning that drivers can now say no to blood tests if pulled over for suspicion of driving while intoxicated. One local Rio Grande Valley Police Department believes the court's decision was fair. We've been doing this uh, for a while, so, you know, it, it's more evidence to be supported while going to court, going to trial. Local attorney Al Alvarez says the order will be helpful to both the accused driver and the police department as it allows drivers to feel less criminalized if they refuse, but also warns that it could affect past cases. If there's any pending cases, this law applies and it will make the, uh, the taking of that blood uh, unconstitutional if they didn't have a warrant. This new order that was just passed down, however, won't hinder police enforcement for the 4th of July weekend. The district attorney has advised that he will have uh, judges available. Uh, he will have phlebotomists already available at our sites where we run these, these tests. You know, if we are required to obtain a blood specimen, then it will be through through a warrant. All in all, law enforcement agencies are prepared to handle drunk drivers, so they want to leave the public with an important message now that the 4th of July holiday is coming up, as well as a statewide program to reduce DWI related accidents. Be wise if you're out to have a good time, if you're going to have some alcohol in your system, uh, get a designated driver, you know, because there's more and more law enforcement and your chances are that you're going to be caught. In Hidalgo County, Imelda Mejia, CBS 4 News and ValleyCentral.com. Police officers do not need a warrant again to conduct a breathalyzer test, but blood cannot be drawn unless a warrant is issued before they do so.